Hi and welcome to Clapia. In this video, we shall look at how to add users and provide them with necessary permissions. Users can be added by adding them to the workplace first and then assigning them their respective application or by assigning them an application and they would be added to the workplace by default. Let us look at how to add users to the workplace. Once you access your workplace, on the left panel, you would have dashboard, create app, app templates, and workplace details. Click on workplace details, and you would have four options, users, preferences, groups, and billing. Under users, you would see the list of users who have access to this workplace. As of now, you can see that there is an administrator for the workplace. Under invite users, you can add the users using their email IDs. And if you are inviting multiple users, make sure that you put a comma between the email IDs. I'm adding a user for this particular workplace. Once the user has been added, an email would be sent across to the user. And if you wish to, you can make him the workplace admin by enabling this option on the right panel. Once the user opens Clappy application, you would see that he would have no access to any of the applications in the workplace. The administrator need to provide him access to the applications. Let us provide the user access to an application. We need to access the application and on the right panel you would have submissions, edit app and add users. Let's click on add users. Once we do so, user access is one of the options. Click on it. In here, I'm going to click on your company and provide them with submitter permissions and click on assign. There are other permissions that the user can be assigned. Submitter, full data access, full data admin, reviewer, app admin, and custom permissions. You can choose custom permissions and provide them with necessary options as per the business needs. As of now, let me provide them with submitter and access and click on assign. Once the user has been added successfully, he should be able to access the application on his mobile phone. You can see now that he has access to stock check t-shirt application. Let us now go ahead and remove the user from the workplace. Again, clicking on workplace details and choosing the user and on the right panel, we can click on remove user. Once I do so, the user will lose access to all the applications under this particular workplace. Let us open Clapia on the mobile phone. And you can see that he has no access to any of the applications on the mobile phone. As mentioned earlier, an administrator can access a particular application and provide access to users here so by clicking on user access an invitation can be sent directly and click on invite also he can be provided permissions and click on assign and you can see the user has been added successfully and now when he goes back to the mobile phone and tries to access the application, you can see that he has access to StockCheck t-shirt application. And he has been added to the workplace. 
that's it for this video in this video we have looked at how to add users to applications and to the workplace and also how we can provide permissions based on the business needs we've also looked at how the user will be able to access applications on his mobile phone based on the permission provided if you have any further questions you can always chat with us or you can schedule a call and we would call you back to help you further thank you very much for your patience goodbye